This one here is C9H10O, as such it has five double bond equivalents. Looking at the pieces, we have a 5H, that's in the aromatic region between 7 and 8, that would be a C6H5. We've got a 2H and a 3H, certainly can't be an NH2, there's no nitrogens in the compound, that has to be a CH2, so 1CH2, and the 3H, that has to be a CH3. Now if you look at what's left over, once we've gotten the pieces we can see, you can see that there are things that we still have to account for. We've got 1C, 1O, and a double bond equivalent. That would suggest that what's left is a C double bond O. Those are all the pieces, now we have to put them together. I bring this down here, and then I've got a couple of possibilities. There are two possibilities. I could put the C double bond O here, and CH2 here, and the CH3 here. If I chose this as a possibility, what would this would mean is that the CH2 and the CH3 would see each other. The CH2 would couple to the CH3 and have four peaks. The CH3 would couple to the CH2 and have three peaks. As you can see, these are single peaks, which means they, do, they don't see each other. So there's only one way that they could possibly be, and that's like this. I also want to point out something else that you can use to help you with this one. When you've got one thing attached to an aromatic ring, there are a couple of ways or a few ways that you can see the peaks. When you've got a C double bond O directly connected to the aromatic ring, it often splits the peaks and you'll see it around here in the uh, 7.6 region split up into two peaks. When there's an alkyl or a CH something attached to the aromatic ring, it usually appears as a single peak. Now going back to what we saw, you can see that the aromatic ring is just attached to an alkyl group which suggests a single peak. And when I say single peak, I'm talking about a peak that's not split apart. Now had it been like this, then the C double bond though would have moved this peak a little bit downfield, more around here, and split it into two parts. And that's just not what we're seeing here. So the answer is going to be this.